today's video I will show you how to get down and up to bridge. So I will do back bend and come up from bridge straight away. First I will do back bend. My hands will touch the ground and then I will come up from bridge. Your legs will do all the work. That's why I will show you specific warm-up exercises exactly for leg strengthening. In my previous videos I showed you how to do back bend and how to come up from bridge. But today I will do both of them. I will show you how to do back bend and immediately get up from bridge. In my previous videos I showed you that separately. In one video I showed you only how to do back bend. And in other video I showed you only how to come up from bridge. But now I will show you how to do them both in one video. So, to get down and immediately get up to bridge, you will need to have momentum. Momentum means that you rock forth and back until you have that swing and you can come up from bridge. So, to do back bend and to get up from bridge, you need more force, more momentum and more strength in your legs. That's why I will show you specific strength exercises for legs which I haven't shown you before. And I will show you how to rock forth and back while you are in bridge in order to get up from bridge. So, I will show you how to do back bend and get up from bridge without a pause. Just get down into bridge and immediately get up from bridge. And you will need a lot of momentum to do this. So you need to start in standing position, tall and straight. Start with your arms by your ears. Open your shoulders and reach your arms tall into the sky. Then squeeze your butt and slowly go backwards. With your head back and at the same time, open your chest and reach your straight arms back. Keep your arms going back along with your head and then push your hips forward. As you push your hips forward, reach your hands as close to your feet as you can and look for the ground. Keep pushing your hips forward and keep your legs as straight as you can as long as you can. And go backwards with control. You must arch your back when you already see the ground. You need to land softly on the ground with your hands. Don't fall but touch the ground with your hands, slow and soft. When you stand up from bridge, move your feet closer to your hands. Because then you have support to push yourself up. Another tip is momentum, which I already mentioned before. Rock back and forth to stand up from bridge. But when you have gone down to bridge, then your body weight shifts on your arms and upper back. While you are in bridge, all your body 
body weight is on your arms and legs equally. But when you get up from bridge, then your body weight is only on your legs. Your back must be warmed up and bendy. When you do back bend, your head looks back all the time. And your arms are straight. And you move your hips forward when you do back bend. But when you come up from bridge, you shift all your body towards your legs. And you move your hips forward. Remember, when you come up from bridge, the last thing to come up is your head. Your arms must be straight all the time. Your legs must be slightly bent, but not too much. Because your legs hold all your body weight. But the back is the one that bends. So in today's video, I will show you how to get down and up to bridge. As always, first I will show you specific warm-up exercises, which you will need for bridge. You must warm up your back to be able to get down and up to bridge. You need to have strong legs in order to get down and up to bridge. That's why I will show you also specific warm-up exercises exactly for legs. When you come up from bridge, you shift all your body weight towards your legs. That's why you need really strong legs. That's the most important thing. Remember to come up from bridge with control. All your strength has to be in your legs while you come up from bridge. That's why you need really strong legs in order to come up from bridge. Because when you come up from bridge, your legs hold your all body weight and with arms you help to push yourself off the ground. The first thing to come up is your body, then arms and the last thing to come up from the bridge is your head. That's the most important part of this. When you come up from bridge, you must move your hips forward. Remember to hold your arms straight all the time. And the last thing to come up from bridge is your head. So in today's video, I will show you how to strengthen your whole legs. I will show you effective and my favorite strength exercises for whole legs. You need to do these strength exercises for legs every day or at least every second day to achieve strong legs. And what's more, you need to have strong back. Because when you shift all your body weight to your legs and come up from bridge, then your lower back bends a lot. And in order to not feel pain in your lower back, you need to hold your back really strong while you come up from bridge. I will show you how to get down and up to bridge step by step. And I will show you how to strengthen your back so that your back will not hurt. I will show you how to shift all your body towards your legs. When you come up from bridge, then you have to push also with your arms. That's the most important part of this. The most important is to hold with your legs your whole body. 
while you come up with your whole body from the ground. I have done already warm-up exercises exactly for back in my previous videos. But today I will show you different and new warm-up exercises for back flexibility. If you watched my video how to do back bend, then you already saw that I did different warm-up exercises exactly for back. For bridge you need to have also flexible shoulders and arms. Today I will show you also more specific warm-up exercises for shoulders opening, arms, upper back and legs. If you watched my video how to come up from bridge, then you already saw that I did there many warm-up exercises for shoulders opening, arms, upper back and legs. But today I will do different and new warm-up exercises, more specific for back flexibility. Shoulders opening, arms, upper back and legs, which I haven't showed you before. If you haven't seen my videos, how to do back bend and how to come up from bridge, then please go to my channel and check out my videos about how to do back bend and how to come up from bridge. Let's learn how to get down and up to bridge together. Follow along and let's get started.
way to practice and you will get it. Just remember, before you get down and up to bridge, always do warm-up exercises. And move your hips forward and hold your arms straight. Once you have learned how to get down and up to bridge, you can do also many other things. For example, front limber. But that I will show you in my next videos. So, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed my video today. Learn the new warm-up exercises and how to get down and up to bridge. And comment down below what kind of challenges I should do next time. You must check out also my other videos. I have lots of different kind of interesting videos in my channel. I post every Friday. My next video will be very interesting. I can't wait to show you my next video. It will be very exciting. That's why please subscribe so that you will be the first to see my new video. Thank you for watching and see you next Friday as always. Bye!